This is David Mammon of Lotto Odds and Match Three Colors. It is February 20th, 2024. Okay, got good news. We have actually completed the base functionality of the Lotto Pool. Okay, now this is new functionality from the old Lotto Pool and it gives it a lot of power. It is one of the most powerful tools we've created in Lotto Odds and it's going to get even more powerful. I'm going to show you what we're going to be doing next and you'll realize how powerful this thing is going to get. Okay, so we are going to um, release this in beta version, the first step here. Okay, it's limited. Okay, you'll see what I mean when I show you uh, the images, what we're going to be building next. and You'll know exactly it's limited. This purchase button, we're going to um, take this out and put in basically in test mode. So allow you just to practice with it. So I'm going to go over quickly how this feature is working, okay? And it's working perfectly, all right? So, and show you what you can do with it. Then I'm going to show you what we're going to be uh, building next. Right now at this point, we're just uh, setting up the new layout here, okay? Um, that we're going to be releasing hopefully um, by the end of the week, hopefully. Yeah, by the end of the week. So, okay, so anyway, so the first one is the L1 default, as you know. Second one is match three colors. So with match three colors, I'm going to look at here. I'm going to start with the L1 default because I have it right here. See, this is L1 default. You know exactly what that is. I'm not going to keep repeating. Um, you should know. If you don't know, just go past videos and you'll find out what it is. So now, see here, L1 default to hit and miss. Okay, it refers to this. All right, so see here, front the pairs that at the end here. Front pair, front, split back, pair, back, pair, front, pair, back, pair. See that? This is what this is. See this? Hit and win. See it says hit and win. This section hit win, hit win. See that? That's what that is. That specific symbol, right? Hit win. Right there, hit win. And it has the split pair, front pair, back pair, split front, back pair all together. Then it has all. It takes all of them. Right and puts them together, mashes them up. Now, here front pair, front split back pair, back pair, front. See that? That's exactly what I just showed you here on this side. So, say for example, you're looking at this and you think, okay, I think uh, a back pair is going to come out, right? So you just go back pair like that, and it shows you what numbers there are that could wind up winning, right there. If it reduces them, it actually. If the back pair does come out next, for say for example, one of the winners will be one of these purple numbers. Okay, no doubt about it. All right. Say if it's another front pair comes out like that, the winner will be one of the purple numbers. Okay, will be one of the purple numbers. Okay, uh, let's do a split. Split hasn't come out for a while. It splits way down here. So if we do split. Okay, splits, see, a few of those, okay? And it works the same way with here, with here, the match three colors side, which is here. Okay, match three colors. All right, hold on a second. I got to refresh this because I got, I got 822 isolated. All right. Open that, flip it to... Box view. Bear with me. Flip it to box view. All right. All right. All right. So here. All right. Actually, I should have been looking at this here, but still, split is overdue. Anyway, look at this run on this. Look at this run on match three colors, the purple run. A green is overdue on this thing. Look at this purple run. Wow, that is amazing. I haven't seen a long run like... I think this is the first time I've seen a long run like this. Look at this. Look at all that purple. This is what I'm saying. Purple dominates. Purple, purple. You know, purple, purple winds dominate. All right. Anyway, so this is, brings me to another point. 
Um, you can utilize, you can combine these two algorithms from the L1 default and the match three colors. See how purple and purple match? Look at all this purple. Look at all this purple. See that, how they match? So if we're dealing right now with the symbol of hit wins, the hit wins, right? So if you have hit win, hit win, that's what we're dealing with now, okay? And when we complete it, when we complete the lotto pool features, you're going to have all, you're going to have all the symbols in there. I'm going to show you in a minute, okay? But this is what you can do. Say, for example, you think that um, on the match three colors that a front is going to win. See these few here out of the many numbers, 220 numbers? If a front comes out in match three colors, right, on this side here, right, okay, the winner will be one of these purple numbers with the uh, white border. Now, here's what you could do to reduce it. If you think the front will come out with another purple on the L1 default, right, a hit win here as well, you can combine them. You can take this and you could do just all, just hit all. Okay, because you don't know, you, you don't want to worry about what's going to come out. Is another front going to come out, FSB? No, you're just concentrating on a front on this side. So then with this other side, you can do all, all, all the pairs. It's going to help you reduce them. So here, look at that. See that? It's telling you which ones match, which ones combine. L1 default and match three colors. They're combining, so they're doing half. Half solid, half with the border. That means they combined it. So all you do like this, look. It helps reduce it. I'm going to show you how much it reduced it even more. Okay, now you could go back and you could turn this off like that. And look, it took out one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight more numbers, okay, from what you had from the front there. All right, and then you could go and do and do one um, here. You can reduce these even more. Say, for example, the majority of winds wind up landing here, low, high, high, and low, low, high. Okay, so you can wind up reducing them even more here. And since you're in purple here, you can hit this purple and just basically just reduce the numbers um, like that. Okay, you're already in purple, so it just takes out excess numbers. All right, like that. And then you can also figure out, for example, if you think, you know, with colors here, you think the end is going to come out like, see, red, 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 red. Okay, say if you think it's going to be green. You hit with the green and it's not going to be it's not going to be here purple because you're dealing with the green on this side okay hold on there actually when you put the green in there's no purple there's no hidden mitts that's what the program's telling you there's no match there so i wouldn't even play that if i was going to hit i was going to do the front i would just do something like this i'd look at there you go right there or if i was looking at that the red there's none there so it would be this one. It's telling me, the program's telling me this is where the play's at, right there, okay, right there. Now, I could also do this. I could split them, brown and red, like that, you see? And it's telling me where they land, okay? I should turn this off, not to confuse you. That was just, this is just telling you basically, you know, what I just showed you, when the two um, combine, this is it's telling you when if they if the next winner comes out front with this combination, you don't even need to do this with that combination, and you'll have this only see with the black blacked out. That's where they combined it, right? See, I could open turn those off again. There you go. All right, so we're basically dealing with just colors, colors, okay. As we go along, I'm going to show you more of this. I'm going to do more practice videos, and you're going to see how cool it is. But let's make it real simple here, okay? Like I said, if you think, okay, let's look at L1 default. Right here, split hasn't come out for a while. Hasn't come out for a while. Look at that. So, and back, FSB is down here. Let's see FSB. If you think FSB might hit, it's telling you these. And then you can reduce them, utilize this feature. Reduce. Oh, it could work the other way too. So if you think, you say FSB for the front, right? L1 default, and you think a purple is going to come out here, hit and win here, you could go all here, reverse it. See? And here you go. See these? Like that. Okay. All that. 
See that? See how many? Let's see how many reduced when we turn off the match three colors. How much it reduced? Now turn this off. Oops. And you take it back to hit win. There. So it removed all these other colors. See? So if purple and purple, purple, purple come out, hit win, hit win. Okay? And you said SFB was going to be coming out in the front. See? That's the black. Okay? That you highlight. And it helped you remove more numbers. And then you could go further like this. Utilize the features. You think low... You think low, low, high, high would wind up winning? You're working with less numbers. Look how many numbers you're working with. So few. And there. Okay? So, um, do one more. Let's do the split on. Let's do the split on this side. That's how many numbers we have? Very few. Let's see the split on the other side. I'm trying to get it back to default. Split. Very few numbers on that side as well. Very few numbers. And what if we thought it was going to hit purple, purple on both sides? Do all here. And let's see how many numbers it can reduce from there. The split. Maybe down there. No. Now turn this off. Wow, look at that. One, two, three, four, five. Only five numbers to play if purple purple comes out with the split on this side, which is overdue. That is pretty cool. All right, now I'm going to show you what we're going to, uh, what we're working on now, the layout, and then I'm going to show you the other features. Then I'm going to show you the a really cool, powerful feature we're going to create, which is a predict tool, auto predict tool. All right, so. This is what we're working on now to release to you by the end of the week. Okay, it's basically we're just reorganizing the uh, the buttons here. Okay, so to prepare us for what we're about to code next. All right, so and we're making color codes, the colors. So you know, hit and win, hit and wins are purple. You see that and misses are green. So that's what we're going to be adding. Um, and then we're going to add this in here, so you won't have to go look at you know, flip over here, split your screen. You could just utilize this little box here and you can see what patterns are coming out. Okay. And if, and also it will help you back test. For example, if, um, if you look at your state and the state has come out with the winning winnings, but you come here and lot of odds has not updated yet. Guess what? You can test it. Say for example, okay, your state came out with the winner and it came out with a hit win right a hit win with the front okay well you can go you can go here and you can hit it in front hit the front okay whoops it's not the front that's the front right there and you could see hold on a second let me refresh this you can front right there and you could see if your numbers hit or if it's a split or back or if it's a back or if it's a split like which is overdue like that you could see if the purple the winner landed on the purple number okay so it will help you confirm that the system works right so it would have to be if it's a hit and win it'd have to be the purple right okay so anyway so that's what we're doing now we at the end of the week we should release this to you and it's going to be really cool so you'll be able to see here the hit and win and the misses here and the patterns what may come out next All right now after we release this to you um, this week, um, we're going to work on this. This is the final product of the Lotto Pool, which is so powerful. These are all the patterns that would hit in these rows, right? You see here? You see Miss Miss, the greens, the purples, okay? All This is what these are. These are. And you can match them up. Say, for example, you want it to cover all the purple. So whenever a purple wins here on both sides, whenever they match, it doesn't matter if it's a miss win purple or hit win purple. Okay, you choose these. Okay, 
you'll always win. The number you play the numbers, you'll always win when they match up like that. Okay. Um, now and then it's gonna look like this the rest of it. So and then we're gonna add. Now I'm gonna talk about this auto predict feature, which is pretty cool. So you can do this manually by yourself, like just like I showed you before, picking front back pairs. You know, colors. When this is done, you'll be able to pick colors. For example, you see how green came out here, miss, miss, and here was a uh, purple, which I believe was a hit win, right? So if purple is a hit win, it would be this. Purple hit win here, match three colors, was a hit win with here as a miss, miss. So it was this with this right there, and it will show you the numbers down there, and the winner would be there. The winner would be 004, which show up there. Very few numbers, okay? Um, now, if you don't want to do that, all that on your own, we're going to have a, a $1 auto predict feature here where you could click it, pay $1, and you'll see something like this. I'm going to show you, which is pretty cool. All right. It's going to do all the work for you, okay? It's going to basically show you all the patterns that there are, okay? All the patterns that there are. And it's going to divide them into single and double numbers and low-high patterns right there. Okay? Most of the wins, majority of the wins are here with the purples. Okay? And from the purples, the majority of the wins from that is here. Hit, win, hit, win. Okay? They wind up being here. Now, these numbers are dynamic. They constantly change after every drawing. Okay? Rarely do they ever stay the same. Okay? Um, now, here... And we also now added the number search feature. I'm going to show you how this is going to work, and it's pretty cool. So we're going to add all the states, right? So here you're going to have all the states, okay, that you can choose from to play a lotto pool in. And here, when you open up Auto Predict, you'll be able to choose a different states as well, okay? And here, this is really cool. Say, for example, you want to play a certain number like 2, 3, 6, right? But you wanted to have more than one chance to win it, okay? But you didn't know which state had a high probability of also hitting 2, 3, 6, okay, in the next drawing. All you would have to do is enter the number 2, 3, 6, right there, click Apply, and this is what you'll see. You'll see multiple displays from different states, It'll show you 236 in every state. It will show you exactly what pattern it landed on and that it has an opportunity of hitting next. So you can wind up playing those specific states that the program shows you has a high probability of hitting your number. Okay? So you wind up, you only have to play one number, but you'll be able to have multiple chances of winning on that one number. Okay? On that day. And you don't have to just do one number. You could do as many numbers as you want. You could do 10 numbers, 5 numbers, whatever. And it'll show you the states that have those numbers in them that you can play. Okay? So that is what we're going to be working at at the end. Once we finish this, then we're going to be working on Auto Predict. Okay? So the first thing that we're going to do now um, should release it to you. Should be released, um, let's see, by tomorrow. I think just this basic version, right? Then by the end of the week, we're going to release this version, right? And then next week, we're going to... Oh, it should take us one week to code the rest of the stuff once we coded the hit and wins. So a week after that, we'll be able to finish that, okay? But give us two weeks with that, so... I would say give us until mid mid March, if not uh, the first week of. I'd say mid March, I'd say mid March or the first week of March. Around that time, you'll have this all completed, um, with the auto predict. So yeah, so about March fifteenth, you have everything completed. That's what I should say. All right, so watch out for tomorrow when I release it. I'll make another video. Okay, I wish you the best.